So some students might come from countries where contraception might not be fully free. So is everything here in UK available free? In the United Kingdom, within the NHS, every form of contraception is completely free. And that includes any oral form of contraception, any condoms, um, any um, intrauterine device like the coil, um, an implant, um, and also the morning after pill, or what we call the emergency contraceptive pill. So what sort of things would you discuss with a student if they came here the first time about contraception? Um, there are many things that we would discuss with the student regarding contraception. At the University Health Service, if you have never had the contraceptive uh, pill from us before, you would have to see the GP for your first consultation. Um, and at that consultation, the GP would um, check that you, your health is um, okay um, and that the correct form of contraception um, is appropriate for your health. Um, and, and ask you what form of contraception you might prefer. Is there anything students can do if they have unpro unprotected sex or they think the method of contraception has failed? Absolutely. Um, within the first 72 hours after unprotected or failed pr protected sex, um, there's something called the emergency contraceptive pill, which is a tablet to take orally. And you can obtain that at the University Health Service by a nurse or a doctor. Um, you could also obtain that by a number of pharmacies in Sheffield. Um, and you can also obtain that through the walk-in centre at Broad Lane. What would students do if they're worried about having sexually transmitted infection? Sexually transmitted infections can be transmitted through unprotected sex. And any student who feels that they have had unprotected sex can come along to the University Health Service and book directly into either a male sexual health clinic, which is run by our male nurse, or a female sexual health clinic, which is run by our female um, nurses. It's a 20 minute appointment. Um, the majority of that 20 minutes is just asking questions, so um, asking a, a bit more detail a, about the sexual encounter that you may have had. Um, and then an examination, if the patient is happy for that, is done at the very end of that consultation. And some swabs may be taken and sent off to the laboratory, um, and then they would get the results from those tests in usually about a week's time. Thank you for your time again, Rachel. You're welcome. Thanks.